so legit. I just downloaded this game. It was like a games with gold thing. My friend told me it had some weird ass pigs with like some tentacles on their chin. So I was like, I'm about to go download that game to see what it's about. And I swear, this is actually a pretty good story going on in this game. It do got weird ass pigs with tentacles on their chins. But like, the the this guy that you're playing, he's like an old man now. This is old man boss. And uh they used to they used to they used to dispose of bodies for the mob and now you're trying to retire from that and he's trying to convince you not to retire from that and this whole thing is him trying to convince you so i did a couple like quests already i don't know if we can look at this there's somebody's dead right there i don't know if they got the quest but, like the quest markers are like there and there so like you're gonna take him to go do jobs around the house oh i tried to jump over that fence <laughs> And, uh, look, this is the goats. Hold on, where the uh, pigs at? The pigs are up front. They got tentacles on their chin. That's the only reason I, I literally downloaded this. Look. Tentacle pigs. Hey, you're supposed to feed them, like, body parts. I guess he already fed them all the body parts, because, uh, there was some in the, in the trunk, I think. To feed the pigs. But yeah, we're gonna do another quest. But like, cause they like reminiscing and talking about all kind of shit. I guess we uh do the pigs next. The shovel. <laughs> it is so That's it's so bro. dramatic like that. All, all in what? What you think, nigga? Shit. Ah. And what are we supposed to do with this crap? We are going to fertilize. Well, not now. It's October, but we're gonna put it in a nice big pile where it belongs. Uh, we? Well, you did say you wanted to help. Oh, yeah, because you want to help. Yes, I did. So, help. Grab that Pick shovel. that shovel over there. We'll shovel it in, wheel it out, dump it, and we're good. And you do this every day? Mm-hmm. Most every day. And you want to keep doing this every day? It's my routine. Yeah. Shoveling shit. Someone's got to do it. <laughs> that, we uh, shoveling shit. This isn't the first time you And this is... <laughs> This is game. Oh, yeah? Vietnam. Yeah. You know, I did some digging on you, personally, not the shit kind. Know what I found? Uh, I reckon you'll tell me. You went back. Hmm. What happened that day in the valley? You saw the report. I'm not going to talk about it. Come on. No. Suit yourself. But you've got a medal. You didn't have to go back. I had a wife and kid here. In a time where most of us were trying to figure out how to stay home, you went back. You going somewhere with this? Hmm. Think it no, I can't put more in told me why? Nope. While we're okay. shoveling shit. I was recon. You know that, I reckon. I was in the hospital, staring I at can't, the ceiling. I can't put the damn... Magazines next to me on the bed. Oh, okay. I, I just threw a whole fucking shovel. this, uh, moment. A moment of clarity. A revelation. Uh-huh. And the revelation was this. Them protesters weren't doing a damn thing. The, the hippies and the, the bands weren't changing anything. You know who was? The Vietnamese? The Russian? No. The news. You hit someone hard enough day in, day out with the realities of war, pretty soon they'll tire of it. Vietnam, that was our first time that close to war. So, uh, I figured, uh, you figured you ain't the only one of us who's killed people. Mm, why do you think I offered you that job back in 74? Turned it down for the same reason I went back. They were telling us our patriotic duty was to go and fight for our country. <laughs> yeah, kind of wild. Well, that's what I did. You weren't recon when you went back, though. Went back with a camera. Talk to me and let me help with the press, keeping them safe and all that. So I did. And I took pictures. Took all the pictures I could. I fought in a different way. Did you win? We pulled out a nam, didn't we? Mm-hmm. And now you're here. Yep, shoveling shit. Out. Shuffling shit. Yeah. Facts. Shoveling shit. All right, journal. What do we do next? All right, we shovel shit. We gotta milk some goats, feed some horses, and throw some horseshoes. 
So which one is horses? That one? I do. Why do horses like a bear from here? Am I going senile? What the fuck? They're like a bear, eh? Oh, that's a horse. All right, now where the gate open it right here. Let's go feed some horses. But legit, I like the story started, and I was like, "Hold on, this is kind of interesting." So I kept playing, and uh, here I am, still playing. Horse. Oh, I just give it. I just give it an apple. Don't you own a tractor? You biggish. What? What's that got to do with anything? Well, pigs, I guess. Goats, too. Yum, yum, yum. Fellas have chickens and cows. That's all well and good, but... Treated? What's the point of a horse? Horses are God's most beautiful creatures. <laughs> what? You are you eating keep it? keep a horse around because they're beautiful? Horses belong on farms. Uh-huh. Oh, so it's just like legit yeah. eating that shit in one go? For him so you don't ride them. I guess horses do that, don't they? Horse. I don't know. Can't eat him. What's the point? Well, I don't see the point in a farm without a horse. Got to yeah, have a right. horse. Uh, and what's this about them being beautiful? Beautiful, really. Beautiful, he says. Spindly legs and bloated bellies and those weird, weird teeth. Sleep standing up. Who sleeps standing up? Something horses. wrong with that. Aren't you going to say something? One day, one day maybe this fella will understand. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Can uh, I pet it? To me, I mean. I keep apples here because he likes them. Likes the salt lick, too. Want to feed him one? Uh, nah, I'm good. Wait, I legit been feeding this horse this whole time. Suit yourself. All right, here you go, boy. No, no, I got to get going. Why don't you walk on out to pasture rest a spell? Oof. Horses give me the willies. Can't see why. How the fuck you scared of horses, nigga? You kill people. <laughs> you scared of horse? All right, I'm taking one of these. Can I eat it myself? You better not be coming back over here for food. I'm going to eat this apple. I got to eat at the dinner table. Oh, that shit was lit, bro. Not many games let you do that. Here. Horse. Come here. Take this apple from me. Uh. Okay. What to do next? What's this? They let you eat at the dinner table, bro. I gotta go eat breakfast and shit. That shit was cool. Horseshoes. I wanna I just wanna know what the fuck he does to this nigga, because he really pissed. Why not? Why not horseshoe? Doesn't it feel stereotypical? Well, look around. Horseshoes and hand grenades. My nearest neighbor lives so half a mile down the road. It ain't the city. We don't have nightclubs and pool halls to go hang out at. Pool halls? What is this, 1890? This is 1992, friend. We got shopping malls for teenagers, restaurants, clubs, whatever. But pool halls? I don't even know if they had those when I was a kid. Uh -huh. Damn. The time doesn't pass out here as quickly, I suppose. No need for all that uh, uh, stimulation. Ah, so facts, dopamine, horseshoes, overload. Mm -hmm. Motherfuckers are just book? droggers out here now, bro. Straight zombies. Yourself, go fly fishing. Mm -hmm. It sounds idyllic, quaint but idyllic. And you just want to give up this home cooked paradise? Hmm. Oh, I can't say these. That's lonely too. I wonder why. A nice place in the city. Ah, never was one for crowds. Thought you said you were lonely. I'd be just as lonely in a crowd. Holding city, released to throw. Uh, nobody else could really see me. You yep. understand what I was. I'm trash. I I, I, hmm. What? Do I got an aim? After Saigon, when I got back, all these people were hugging their loved ones or. How the fuck do I play? I don't know. I never felt more alone in all my life. I was home. Mm -hmm. I should have been happy. And I fuck. wasn't. Well, it wasn't I want to win. You yep. friends too, right? Yeah. But. Uh, yeah. I got home. It was dark. And there 
Mercedes. I'm losing. Waiting for me. By a lot. Porch light like a halo around her head. And I knew I wasn't alone anymore. Hmm. So you what came the back fuck? To your high school school? Can I cheat? Bob, I thought I, I thought he'd have married her by then. I didn't think she'd wait for me. Fuck. Why not? You're a handsome guy. I bet all sorts wanted you, especially back then. Women love a man in uniform. You see that house on the hill? Uh, what, the burned out one? I always wondered what Fuck. happened there. Gary Gordon. Of the Gordon family. Went to high school with us. Fuck. But, uh, well, most of us were farm folk. Sadie, her dad, was the county judge, so for us, that's pretty high society. Huh. Fuck! The Gordons owned a lot of land, and all that passed to Gary after his ma died. In high school, he'd been our quarterback after his pop paid off the school, but nah, he wasn't a bad athlete. Good-looking guy? Oh, a real James Dean. And he had eyes for some... I don't know who James Dean is. A poor farm boy who couldn't play... Hey, who wouldn't want all this? <laughs> Man, yet, when I came home, there she was. Where was Gary? He served too? Ah, oh, Gary was too rich to serve. Star quarterback had some health exemption. Didn't get drafted. Uh-huh. Uh, so then, where was he? Running his dad's business. Trying to win her heart. <laughs> didn't work. Well, she invited him to the wedding. I didn't want him there, but, well, you know Sadie. Uh-huh. Well... The Gordons own most of the property around here, including the 200 acres surrounding that hill. Right. And he built a house. A house? W wait, that house? The very same. Looks like it was a mansion. It was. Why'd he build it? Uh, I don't know. Trying to get Sadie in there. What she'd given up, maybe. So, what happened to the wealthy Gary Gordon and his mansion? Well, he built it one year. Must have been 1966 or so, and... Damn, that was hell of a And he just disappeared. Then one night, about a year later, there was a storm and boom. No Got more struck? Gary Gordon. No more Gary Gordon. Huh. Maybe he was lonely too. Maybe. That's kind of wild. Did I win? I ran out of horseshoes, so like, what do, what do we do now? Hello? I think the game broke. Hey buddy, you gonna finish throwing these or what? God damn it. I don't know what to do now. I threw all my horseshoes. Um... I don't know. Hey, hey, you good? You, you good? Nah, he's not good, bro. I think I broke the game for throwing all them horseshoes. So I think I'm gonna uh, end this right here. So thank y'all for watching, like, subscribe, and do. I'm gonna finish the rest of the story for sure, bro. I need to figure out what the fuck they're gonna do to him since I'm quitting the mob. And, uh, how to fix horseshoes. I don't even know how to play horseshoes, bro. I'm just throwing them bitches, trying to get it on the ring. Because I know that's what you're supposed to do. Or get it as close to the ring as you can. But it was going up in numbers, bro. I got 4,000. He has 1997. So, yeah, I don't know. So, yeah. I'll see y'all in the next video.